Hello, it's Ruby and today I am finally going to be sharing with you my night routine during lockdown. I have loved spending so much time outside recently, so before dinner I will take a book outside and I will sit there and just read. We have this bench swing on the patio and it's really really rusty as you can see but I just love the antiquity of it and it is my favourite place in the garden to sit and read. And at the moment I am rereading Jaina. Hey Marjorie! So after that I like to play with the dogs for a little bit. I actually did injure my ankle recently and so I wasn't able to play with them for a while but it really is starting to recover now which is amazing. So then on the topic of ankles, I do have some physio exercises which I need to do a few times a day. So here I am doing my third and final set of physio exercises for the day. Then after that we have dinner as a family. So this particular evening my dad cooked, he made this amazing mushroom pasta dish and also some roasted vegetables to go along with it. You've got a garlic clove, Martha, do you want one? <laughs> <laughs> and this particular evening it was a Thursday which means of course at 8 o'clock we all clapped for the NHS <laughs> then after dinner I head up to my room and I just like to do some admin so I will apply to emails I might finish up editing a YouTube video basically any tasks that I still need to get done so that they are completely off my mind and I can relax ready for bed and at the same time as doing this I always like to play some classical music and I will also light some candles because I just love candles The amount of time I spend working on admin really does vary from day to day because obviously it just depends on how many overflow tasks I've got. So after that I like to go through my planner and I will just plan the things that I need to do tomorrow. Either I will use one of my study plans from Pumpkin Productivity or I will just put them into Momentum if I don't have that many tasks. Then I also like to spend some time writing a letter because I do really like to write letters to my friends. So here I am actually just adding on a little note to include in a letter to my friend Andrea which I was planning on sending the next day. will tidy my room before I go and have a shower. Before my shower, of course, I have to take my contact lenses out. Then I had a shower and I just put on this cleanser from Glossier and I go downstairs and I like to make myself some tea. So this evening I had this bedtime tea and I actually had this tea when I went over to Jade's last year and it is one of my favorites to have before bed. So in the evening, my mum and I have been watching the BBC Mallory Towers series. It is 
the best show I have watched since Anne with an E. I love, love the show so, so much. So we have got one episode left, which is really, really sad. And I um, would highly recommend it. So after that, I will go upstairs and brush my teeth. And at the same time, I like to just read through the news. So I go through the New York Times on my iPad. And then I will go and get into bed. So I like to turn on my fairy lights in the evening. I just think it makes my room feel really cozy. And then every evening I like to do the mini New York Times daily crossword. They literally take one minute, but they're just quite fun to do. Some evenings I might also watch something. It depends on how late it is and how tired I am. So I'll either watch YouTube or I might watch Netflix or recently Disney Plus. I'm most likely to sit and watch an episode of The Simpsons. I am a big fan of The Simpsons. After that, I will read. I love to finish every single day with reading. It helps me to get to sleep and I am a huge bookworm, I just enjoy reading, so as I said, I'm reading Jane Eyre at the moment. Then after I read, I will set my alarm and I use the app Alarmy, which basically every morning gives you a task you need to do in order to turn the alarm off, so it's a great way to actually get you up. After that, I will spray my pillow with some pillow mist. I like to put on this lip balm from Glossier. It's the coconut one and it smells amazing. And also because obviously we're washing our hands a lot at the moment, I put on this eczema hand cream. And then I go to sleep. So thank you so much for watching this night routine. I hope that you enjoyed it and I hope that you have a productive week.